I'm going to share with you how to use the people graph in Excel 2013. This is an add-in feature that's uh, available, I believe, in add 13, Excel 2013, Excel 2016, perhaps. I do know you, you definitely need to be logged in um, with your Microsoft ID, Office 365 account or OneDrive account to be able to uh, work with these add-ins here. Mine, I remember, just popped up all by itself one day, I believe. So I was just curious. I just clicked on that and I thought, hey, this would be a good time to share with you how to do this. Click on People Graph. It will create a chart that's resizable. And then um, in order to make this work, you're going to kind of hover over the People Graph, click on the what looks like a spreadsheet. That will select your data. We're looking for uh, two columns, just simple two columns in the spreadsheet to make a selection here. And then create. Okay, cool. Uh, the title, we can click back and choose the title. New customers by referral type, let's say. Now, I click on the gear in the upper right hand corner to pick a different type. I can click on theme to modify its theme. like that one here and then lastly we click on shape to be able to change the shape whichever you think is appropriate right pretty cool so all in all it's not too hard it takes you a minute or two to get some kind of a graph situated there and then when you're done you can uh, put your mouse on one of the edges here and resize it And this would be something that you could easily place in a PowerPoint presentation just by right clicking on the edge and selecting copy, opening up a PowerPoint presentation and pasting. And uh, that should be really, really easily ready to go there. But it will be part of the workbook if you save the workbook and ready to go. And if numbers do change, let's see what happens here. Let's make our cold calls go from 202 to 215. Yes, you can see it's linked just like that. Cool. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed learning about the people graph inside of Microsoft Excel 2013 or 2016.